Good morning, Christ Church International. This is your pastor, Pastor Daryl John Geddes, and these are your CCI announcements for Sunday, July 19th, 2020. This is our third Sunday meeting face to face. God's gonna make it. God's gonna make it. God's get to make it. Proverbs 17, says, A merry heart doeth good like a medicine. Well, this week, we've got a comedian by the name of Michael Jr., and he's going to share with us the why behind your what. How do I know? A lot of people, when they think of the phrase, how do I know, they always want to put the what behind it. How do I know what I'm supposed to do? The, the question that you really should ask is, how do I know why I'm here? Because when you know your why, your what becomes more clear and more impactful. If you know, like for instance, um, people know that I do comedy, but that's what I do. My why is to inspire people to walk in purpose. So I can do comedy, I can write books, I can be in a movie, because all of it is motivated by my why. In fact, I have a new, uh, a new web series out called Michael Jr. Break Time. Uh, we probably just did the sixth episode. It's on YouTube. So every single Wednesday at 3 o'clock, we drop a new episode on YouTube of Michael Jr. Break Time. What it is is it's me. I travel around the country, and I do stand-up comedy, in case you didn't know. <laughs> and in the middle of my comedy set sometime, I'll stop and just talk to my audience. And we've been filming this, and it's... You know, it's, it's pretty cool. So we're in Winston-Salem. I'm gonna show you a clip from Winston-Salem. And I'm just talking to this guy in the audience and he tells me that he's a, uh, a musical instructor at a school. So I was like, all right, you're a musical instructor. You know, can you sing? Let me hear you sing a song. So this is what happened at the last episode of Michael Jr.'s Break Time. Check it. So you're a musical director. Cool. Yes, sir. All right, so um, let, me get a couple, let me get a couple bars of like uh, Amazing Grace. Can you do the first part of that? Let me, go ahead. Amazing grace, how sweet the sound that saved a wretch like me. Wow. That brought could sing. You know what I'm saying? All right, all right. Uh, now, once you give me the version, is if. Uh, your uncle just got out of jail. You got shot in the back when you was a kid. I'm just saying, let me see the hood version real quick. If you know which version I'm talking about, just see if that exists. Let me see what you got. Amazing grace, how sweet the sound that Okay, um, here's what I want you to catch. The first time I asked him to sing, he knew what he was doing. The second time, he knew why he was doing it. When you know your why, your what becomes more impactful because you're walking towards or in your purpose. As of July the 5th, the CCI board and the pastoral staff has decided that we would begin to meet again face to face. And we're excited uh, just to see one another and to gather together in one place on one accord. Praise the Lord. 
But don't get too excited because there are some basic things that we must follow to make sure that everyone is safe when you come. First of all, for those of you all who don't feel safe in attending a face-to-face -face service at this time, uh, for our seniors and for those who have compromised immune systems, don't feel pressured to attend. You can pick up the live stream of our service on Sunday mornings at 10 a.m. Number one, first of all, we're expecting that all who attend our face-to-face -face service wear a mask. And this is for the safety of all who are joining us for face-to-face -face services. Number two, each attendee must allow their temperature to be taken as they enter the building. If your temperature is normal, a mittens will be granted. But if your temperature is above normal, we will encourage you to leave the premises for the safety of others and seek medical consultation. Number three, after having your temperature taken, each attendee will go to our sanitizing stations and will sanitize their hands making sure that their masks are adjusted properly, and then they will enter the sanctuary where, number four, someone will lead you to a seat marked off to ensure proper social distancing. Number five, masks are required during worship. Number six, we will maintain the four different giving options uh, that we created during the COVID-19 pandemic restrictions. Also, we will have an offering plate at the door as you exit the sanctuary. And last but not least, at the conclusion of the service, attendees will be dismissed by section. We will not be lingering for fellowship, but will move from the sanctuary to the parking lot and then to our prospective homes. Thank you so much for understanding and cooperating with us as we attempt to provide the safest atmosphere that we can for those of you all who want to meet face to face for worship. Hey, this is your pastor. Just wanted to let you know we just finished with our bags of hope and you will be proud of us because we gave out over 160 boxes and 160 bags to needy people on the south side of Minneapolis. I tell you, that really hypes me up because I am letting my light shine. We are letting our light shine before them that they may see his good works and glorify the Father which is in heaven. Hey, just wanted to stop by to let you know that the real is back. That's right, you heard me. The real is back. The women's ministry is moving to a Zoom format. And on August the 22nd at 7 p.m., they are going to bring real encouragement for real unusual circumstances during a real unique times. You don't want to miss it. Check Planning Center and ccilife.org for more information. For more information, as always, log on to ccilife.org where you will find links to our online sermons, our online giving, and links to all of our social media networks. This has been your pastor, Pastor Daryl John Geddes, and these have been your Christ Church International announcements. I sincerely hope you enjoy the rest of the service. Now please stand as we continue in praise. God's gonna make it! God's gonna make it!